Hello, race fans, and welcome back to the More Freedom Series. Today, we have traveled to the Milwaukee Mile for the Milwaukee 60. This is going to be race number 17 in the More Freedom Series, season four. And with only this two races left until halfway, let's go through your current top 10 in points. Your points leader is the 49 of Jetman. Second's going to be the 20 of Adam B5000. Third will be the double zero of Mudbone. Fourth will be the 544 of Frederick Winklebaum. Fifth will be the 799 of Mike Check. Sixth will be the 40 of Veteran Chaos. Seventh will be the 72 of Duchess. Eighth will be the three of Geek Girl Games. Ninth will be the 95 of Zed Brenna. And rounding out your top 10 will be the 11 of TC Roberts. Let's check in on your team and chassis standings. MBR still leads the way with Douche Motorsports second. Aces to Zed Motorsports third. Amish Buggy Racing fourth. And the Drop Bear Racing team in fifth. Your chassis stands in standings look like this. Dodge has commanding lead over Chevy, Toyota, and Ford. So that's a look at everything points-wise for this Milwaukee 60 here at the Milwaukee Mile. Uh, fans are sort of piling in. It's, it's hot out here, but I think it's about time, so let's go racing. Let's go through your starting top 10 today for this Milwaukee 60. Starting on the pole will be the 88 of NM, and on his outside, the 23 of Fuller Than You. Starting third will be the 72 of Duchess, and on her outside, the 799 of Mike Check. Starting fifth will be the 07 of Douche Baggins, and on his outside, the 356 of Ice Cream Some Days. Starting seventh will be the 666 of Pistol Pete, and on his outside, the 29 of Wishbone Attack. Starting ninth will be the 300 of Resemble, and rounding up your top 10 will be the 96 of Nico. So that's a look at your top 10. Starting top 10 today for this Milwaukee 60. NM is going to be leading us down to take the green flag here today, right behind that beautiful orange and black Dodge Challenger base car. Uh, so we're going to see what NM has in store for the Milwaukee Mile, as this is our second visit to it here this season and last visit this season to the Milwaukee Mile as that beautiful orange and black Dodge Challenger base car ducks off. The green flag is out, and we are underway. <laughs> Heading down into turn one, NM already has a lead over second place. That's 72 of Duchess and her teammate and car owner, 07 of Douche Baggins, right behind her. The 23 of Fuller Than You uh, trying to do it on the outside right now. It is able to make the pass on the 72 of Duchess, sending her back to third place as we, bat as we have a battle for the fourth position between the 07 and the 799 as the 88 of NM will lead lap number one here at Milwaukee with the 23 of Fuller Than You right there on his back bumper. Let's bring up your timing and scoring. As always, top 10 will be on your left. Favorite driver scrolling across the top as NM still leads away here on lap number two, followed closely by the 23 of Fuller Than You and is it racing down to single file now as the 72 and the 07 make it three and four. Fifth place is gonna to go to the 666 with the 799 of Mike Check taking over the sixth position as the 356 and the 300 battle it out for seventh with the 29 of Wishbone Attack right behind the 300 of Resemble. And Resemble's teammate, the 999 of Deviant, who almost is three wide right now between the 999 and the 96 is that high line is not the preferred line here at Milwaukee as we see the 356 trying to battle on the outside. She almost into the left right rear quarter of that 300. She's gonna have to woe up into the turn as the 29 of Wishbone Attack dives down to her inside. Right behind him is that 11 of TC Roberts. Let's check in on up here at the front as we see the 88 with a battle between himself and the 23 of Fuller Than You. Fuller Than You already going for the lead, but the 88 of NM trying it on the outside right now, diving into three and four. So he is battling right now with the 23 of Fuller Than You right here at Milwaukee. As Fuller looks like he's gonna be able to lead that lap, he might take over the lead here from NM as he now has about half a car length up on him. He will be able, I think he's gonna get it on the, on the back stretch here as we see the 07 take away that position from the 72 of Duchess. So DB into the third position right now. He is looking to capitalize on this battle between the 23 at Fuller Than You. 
and the 88 of NM, and I think he will as NM is going to slide in behind. He is going to go high here as the 07 of Douche Baggins ducks underneath him and a battle for the second position. So first to second right now, NM getting a little bit of a room here. Dives down in front of that 07 of Douche Baggins. He is going to keep the second position from the 23 of Fuller than you who takes over the lead here. So NM able to lead four laps. Uh, Fuller now three laps led as we saw some skid marks right there. Looking at your timing and scoring, nobody has crashed out. Again, a hot one here today at Milwaukee, upper 80s, probably reaching into the 90s at this point. Track is going to be hot and slick. It's hot up here in the booth. Got to hydrate for this race as this battle for second rages on between the 07 and the 88 as we saw the 666. The Pistol Pete now into the fourth position in front of the 72 of Duchess as we see the 799 of Mychek down to the inside of his teammates. The 300 of Resemble, so Resemble falling back, I think. Uh, looking at scoring, I think Resemble was trying it on the outside, actually. So Mike Check trying to keep his position on the inside. Resemble battling him on the outside. That might be detrimental for Resemble, as I think the 356 of Ice Cream some days may have a word to say about this battle, as she might get down to the inside of the 300 of Resemble. Looks right now that that 23 of Fuller Than You has a fantastic car today. The Corsair Toyota for Aces to Z Motorsports. So Resemble, or I'm sorry, we heard I uh, heard some tire squeeching, scre squealing, screeching, squealing. Her tire noise just then on the track. Not sure where that was from, but excuse me, we're still under green here on lap number 11. As DB looking down, I think he's going to try to make the pass down to the inside here into turn one. He's going to dive down to the inside of the 88 of NM. Looking for second position is the 07 of Douche Baggins. I'm not sure if they've missed on the setup for the 88 of NM or not, but he's fallen back just a, a little bit here at the beginning as I'm probably driving on the outside. That battle for the first position probably wore, his, wore down his tires. As it looks like DB right now has the second position as the 666 of Pistol Pete right to his back bumper right now. So off of turn two, the 07, Douche Baggins up to the second position and then back to third. He's in trouble, but he might lose a third to the 666 of Pistol Pete right here. So Pistol Pete is desperately trying to do something here in the series. He's a rookie and currently resides in the last place in points. So he is, he's been, he's been in a rough go. He's had a rough go of a lot of things this season is that, that 666 and uh, involved in several cautions. If you'll recall, he got into an incident with the, the 211 of Hogs not that long ago and literally spun him off the turn, but He's trying his hardest right now for the Amish Buggy Racing Team in the Advanced Auto Parts Dodge. As we see the 72 of Duchess right there on his back bumper. NM still battling on the outside right now with Pistol Pete, but he is in trouble. He might lose third, fourth, fifth, might be back to sixth position after the end of this. Duchess. Still underneath him right now. He's going to lose that position to the 666 as we check in on your leader, the 23 of Fuller Than You. Uh, currently up eight tenths of a second over DB, who is extending his lead over the 666, the 88, the 72, and the 300. We see Mike Check falling back a little bit right now as the 203 of Signs working around his outside. So Signs is going to get, is it currently in the eighth position around the outside of the 799 of Mike Check, putting Mike Check back to the ninth position right there in front of the, two, the 11 of TC Roberts. As we see second place in points, the 20 of Adam B5000 underneath the 29 of Wishbone Attack, currently battling for the 11th position here. We'll jump back up here and see finally NM able to get down to the bottom of the track. 
Uh, Pistol Pete able to finally make it to the third position right there. So we're going to see how NM's tires are after that long extended battle on the outside between himself and the 666 and the 07 and the 23. As we check in on your leaders, the 23 of Ford of the new is slowly losing time to the 07 of Douchebag. And so DB looks like he might have a good car underneath him here today for Douche Motorsports and that ghost Chevy Monte Carlo. Checking in on this field, the 72 of Dutch is right there to the back bumper of the 88 of NM. As we do see three of the top 10 right now are those douche motorsports cars as we got the 203 of signs in eighth position. Their other teammates, the eight of Moon Bunny currently resides in the last position. Uh, the 329 of Heck of a Duber 15th and the 211 of Hogs running 28th right now. So we see Signs is now caught up to the back bumper of the 356 of Ice Cream some days. Ice Cream again. Another rough season for Ice Cream again. She uh, her third different third different team, I do believe, over the last three seasons. Um, maybe the last four seasons. She's still getting acquainted with that Chevy for G3 Motorsports for her Publix. Monte Carlo right there as we see the 203 of Signs diving down to the inside. Here it looks like the Chevys for Douche Motorsports have a lot under the hood here at Milwaukee. As we do see DB is slowly creeping up. Knocked another tenth of a second off the 23 of Fuller than News lead right now. We're going to see what it is after this lap as we're currently running on lap number 22 here today. 17 laps, eight, I think eight, 17 laps led by your leader, the 23 of Fuller than you. Uh, NM led the first four laps and Fuller took over after that. Currently it was the lead in the way as DB again is knocking tenths of a second off per lap right now. I do believe DB is looking for his first win of the season. Uh, this this year in the more freedom series. I don't have those stats up with me right now, but I think he is looking for his first win this season. And Fuller may have won already. I can't. It's been a long season already. We're, you know, you'll see those stats later on. Oh, no, you won't actually see who's won, but, you know, we'll see points later, I guess. So checking back through this field. Signs is able to make the pass on the 3.56 of ice cream some days as the 11 of T.C. Roberts thinking about jumping down to the inside of the 7.99 of Mike Check as we see the 6.60 of Garrett Miller down to the inside of the 20 of Adam B5000. Garrett, again, rough go this season for that 6.60 of Garrett Miller currently running the 28th in points. Um, I think he's won almost... He's won at least one race in every season that he's been in so far. So he's had, I think he's had at least two wins here in the More Freedom Series. Again, the top, the most wins in the series so far are five by G3, which I think she had four of them last year. So we see 329 of Heck of a Duber is now raced his way up to the 14th position. Jump back through this field as we see the 51 of AJM down to the inside. The 71 of Kung Fu Beer. Kung Fu Beer, great run off of turn two. He's going to be able to keep that position from right now by the, from the 51 of AJM. So AJM, who uh, started 24th, currently resides in the 21st position. So actually, KFB on the outside for that 51 as we do see less side damage. On well, the 51 of AJM, maybe that was what the uh, tires, you know, the skid marks were there in turn two. But he does have the fastest lap on the day at 135.201 miles per hour or 26.627 seconds. So his car was hooked up earlier in the run. And again, last week he was in line for that win, but a blown tire took him out of the race right there at the end or he would have pulled out the win for NBR last week. As we see the 420 at Queen of Hearts down to the inside of the 25 at JTM. 
This is currently a battle for the 24th position as I think JTM's trying it on the outside right now on that 420 at Queen of Hearts because Queen had that spot over him in the last couple laps. So not quite sure of the dynamic going on right there as we see our points leader, the 49th Jetman battling out with third place in points. The double zero of Mudbone currently for the 28th position. As we see that eight of Moon Bunny. Oh, we do have pit stops happening right now. See the 356 is in, the 88, the 23. So your leader into the pits right now. We'll watch the 23 of four of the new come in. We see the 88 slide into his pits. Right side tires going on for your leader, the 23 of four of the new. Left side tires going on, fuel going in. See left side tires going on to that 88 of NM. Fuller is down and away. We'll watch NM as he gets that fuel. He's finally down and away. He's going to gank it out maybe in front of that 203 of Signs. Signs is going to get that position away from the 88 of NM. Also, the 356 may make that pass here. We're going to see as they come off the track. So NM going to keep that position. As we see Fuller making his way around the track here. We're going to see if he takes over the lead as the 666 coming out. Here's the 07. He's getting that car wound up. It's going to be close. He's going to pull out in front of that 23, a fuller than you down the back stretch. As we see, see, oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. You saw it live right here on the track, folks. Right here on the track, the 23 of Fuller Than You. Rex, the 07 of Douche Baggins for the lead. Flips him over. My goodness. In an insane turn of events here at Milwaukee, the 23 of Fuller Than You. Rex, the 07 of Douche Baggins for the lead. I am stunned, folks. I am stunned. I am not sure what Fuller was thinking there, but we're going to watch that. And I, I mean, Maybe, maybe that was DB's fault, but we're going to watch that back right now as no takers for pit road. Well, we're going to watch this, and this is an absolute just wreck fest by the 23 of Fuller Than You. From the roof cam of the 23, a fuller than you. From the in car camera for the 07 of Douchebaggins. So the 23, a fuller than you. Puts the 07 into the wall, flips him over, puts him out of the race. And just, I am dumbfounded here. And I was about to note that the 777 of Seabass is out of the race as well. He was involved in some sort of incident. Uh, not sure what happened to him. But Seabass continues just a rough streak here in the more freedom series as he may have gotten into it with the 25 and JTM JTM showing one lap down right now. So we'll bring up your timing and scoring again. As Fuller is going to be leading his back to take the green flag with the 666, the pistol Pete on his outside. Coming down to take that green flag here. Green flag is out. We're back underway. We're going to see what Pistol Pete has for that 23 of Fuller than you. As we know, Fuller not afraid to put a bumper on somebody. He's done it multiple times here in the series. 
uh, wrecking out people as the 666 of Pistol Pete is going to be able to jump back to the lead right here. Actually, he's going to take over the lead from the 23, a fuller than you. So Pistol Pete takes over the lead from the 23 of Fuller Than You after that restart. Uh, he is looking to have a good day here today. He needs to keep an eye on his mirror as the 23 Fuller Than You is, again, known wrecker here in the series as he's jumping down to the inside of the 666 of Pistol Pete. So got to be weary here as he is down to his inside. As we see a battle for the third, second and third, or the third position right now. So very close for that lead as Pistol Pete jumping back down there for Amish Buggy Racing. Going to try to win one for his team owner, the 777 of Bass, who again is out of this race. As we watch this battle for the lead, the 23, fuller than you, getting down to his inside, almost with a little tap on the left rear on that 666 of Pistol Pete. Fuller, once that lead back, uh, will stop it. Absolutely nothing to get it here at Milwaukee with the 203 of signs right now in hot pursuit of the 23, a fuller than you. We see the 88 of NM getting down to the inside of the 356 of Ice Cream some days who had had a great pit stop there and had gotten up into the sixth, sixth position, fifth, fifth position. Well, she would have been in sixth if it wasn't for the 23. As we're watching the 203 of Science make that pass on the 666 of Pistol Pete and possibly the 80 of, 88 of NM gonna make that pass as well. As he's working down to the inside, he is getting around the 356 of Ice Cream some days. Here comes the 72 of Duchess. I think uh, the 203 and the 72 are going to be looking out. They're going to be wanting blood from that 23 of Fuller Than You. They're going to want to avenge their car owner, the 07 of Douche Baggins here. I mean, I would not be surprised if DB's not waiting for a four by his hauler afterwards after this race with the tire iron. It could be a wild scene down there in the pits this evening as the 203 of Signs takes away the second position as the 88 of NM working on the third position from the 666 of Pistol Pete and the 356 of Ice Cream some days following right behind him right on his back door. Thinking about maybe making a three wide was a 356. She's thinking better of it right there. As NM working down again, still working down to the inside. Hopefully they got some better tires on the 88 as he gets around the 666 of Pistol Pete. Jumps on the brakes, makes the 666 check up right there. That's going to allow the 356 to follow along. And here comes the 20 of Adam B5000, second place in points. Check it in on your points leader, the 49 of Jetman, currently residing in... Oh, he is 18th on the track right now. So this could be a good points day for the 20 of Adam B5000. Maybe take over that points lead from the 49 of Jetman as we watch the 356. She's going to work her way into uh, the fourth position as she gets around the 666 of Pistol Pete. Fall into line right there as Pistol Pete trying to cross over move into the turn. Check in on your front runners. The 23 the Fuller Than You currently has about a five tenths of a second, half second lead over the 203 of signs. Uh, current fastest lap is going to be by the 88 of NM. So he took over the fastest lap from his teammate, the 51 of AJM. I think it was a faster lap, laps time-wise, but not necessarily lap speed-wise, I think. Not sure about that. Uh, it was 135.298 miles per hour, by the way. I should have said that. As we see him working single file, as here comes the 999 of Deviant. Again, Deviant, four, 
Missed the first four races, up to 31st in points, currently running eighth position right now on the track with most of his, the rest of his team right there near him. As a 300 of Resimble, his other teammate working underneath the 11 of TC Roberts. So Resimble having a good day here today. Resimble, who has been in the top 10, was in the top 10 most of the season, has fallen back to the 16th position. As we see the 329 of Heck of Duber and the 71 of Kung Fu Beer battling it out with the 799 of Mike Check right now. Looks like the 11 of TC Roberts going to keep that position over the 300 of Resemble for the 9th and 10th. Jump back up to the front, see if Science is working on anything as slowly creeping up on the 23 of Fuller Than You. We'll check in on the back of the pack as the 25 of JTM currently resides in the last position. JTM has had a few great races, so he was, a, he was definitely involved in something as he has two pit stops on the day, so I'm not sure what happened to the 25 at JTM, but he is currently residing in the last position. As a note, he was a lap down at the start, and with the new rules in the More Freedom Series, he was able to get his lap back. As we watch the double zero of Mudbone and the 211 of Hogs battling her right now on the track for the 30th position. So the 29 of Wishbone Attack, who started eighth, has fallen steadily back here today. Just jumping through this field as we see a lot of action here on the track. See the 13 of King of the Aces down to the inside of the 40 of Vetra Chaos as the 34 of Super Snake. Several Amish buggy racing cars right there, the 34 and the double zero battling on the track. Do see a little bit of that damage fixed up on that 51 of AJM, so probably an extended pit stop for him. He currently runs 20th as he made his way around the three of Geek Girl Games. As we watch the 10 of Scooter down to the inside of the 660 of Garrett Miller. Scooter has been on a, quite a run in the last couple races. I think two or three top 10s, maybe a couple top fives right there. He is now resides 17th in points. As there's your points leader, the 49 of Jetman running 16th right now. Get back up here towards the front as we see the 203 of Signs is still about half a second off the back bumper of that 23 of four of the Neal. Uh, maybe just biding his time right now. Signs is that 203 of Signs as, you know, bide your time, get up there. Listen, there, there may be some chrome horn involved here. That's all I'm saying. I mean, I could see it happening, but you never know. Signs is a clean racer, but, you know, team orders are team orders. You know what I'm saying? As the 88 of NM slowly tracking down that 203 of Signs with the 356 ice cream some days right there in tow. Again, a great race so far. Knock on wood for that 356 of ice cream some days. Just having a better race than she's had most of the season right now. Again, currently running fourth on the day as we probably have one mo. We've got six laps to go here at Milwaukee, so it's going to be close, I think, here at the end of the race as to what the pit stop situation is going to be as Buller, you know, knocking down another lap here at Milwaukee. Uh, not sure if he is, if they are going to be in line for another pit stop or if they're going to make it all the way here today. I assume, we'll soon find out. As I can't, I can't remember what lap they stopped on. I think it was in the twenties, but I don't know. It's there's been a lot of excitement since the pit stops. So with four laps to go, your leader still is the 23 of fuller than you. I'm not sure if they go the rest of the distance, if the 203 of Science has anything for him. As Science has finished top five several times this season. And definitely looking for a win here. But fuller than you. I'm not sure. I mean, that was just such a sketchy incident. I mean, I just dumbfounded by why Fuller would pull off that move here. Checking back through this field. Pretty much single file right now all the way back. 
as we watch them battling it out. I mean, really our only battle on the track right here is the eight of Moon Bunny and the 29 of Wishbone Attack. So we'll check in on the flag stand right here. So Fuller is gonna get the white flag this time around. It looks like it is, it is his race to win here in the More Freedom Series in controversial, controversial fashion. Fuller is gonna take the white flag here at Milwaukee. Down into turn one and two for the final time is your leader. The 23 of Fuller than you, so Major controversy after this race as he heads down the back stretch into three and fourth for the final time. Your leader is the 23 of Fuller than Yield, making his way off of turn four, heading down to the stripe. Your winner here today, again, in controversial fashion, is the 23 of Fuller than you. I don't even, listen, folks, I don't even know what to say about that. That was an interesting. Interesting race here in the More Freedom Series, but let's go through your finishing top 10. Again, your winner is the 23 of Fuller Than You. Second's going to be the 203 of Signs. Third will be the 88 of NM. Fourth will be the 356 of Ice Cream Some Days. Fifth will be the 666 of Pistol Pete. Sixth will be the 72 of Duchess. Seventh will be the 20 of Adam B5000. Eighth will be the 999 of Deviant. Ninth will be the 11 of TC Roberts. And rounding out your top 10 will be the 300 of Resemble. Wow, excitement here today at Milwaukee, and I think next week will be even more exciting as we head to the super-duper Mega Super Speedway. We're going to go to Fort Wayne for the Fort Wayne 100, so that should be a high-speed, interesting affair next week at Fort Wayne. Also, let's, ch let's, let's go right to your current points as the 49 of Jetman is going to finish 16th today and the 20 of Adam B5000 is going to finish 7th. So you're seeing your points here on the screen. Let's check in on your team and chassis standings as we'll see you a good day for Douche Motorsports. Well, that's going to do it here today for this Milwaukee 60, a win in very, very, very controversial fashion over the 07 of Douche Baggins, or the 23 of Fuller Than You wins after that wreck of the 07 of Douche Baggins. So a lot of controversy will be surrounding this. I'm not sure if uh, the More Freedom Series will take action on that or not, if they'll consider that a racing incident, but... Um, yeah, very con a lot of controversy right there from the 23 of Fuller Than You. He is your winner today. But that's going to do it for us here at Milwaukee. And until next week at Fort Wayne for the final race of the first half of Season 4, take care.